Oh, hey guys, you're stuck at home too. So am I. You're probably pretty bored. Uh, I've been doodling to kill some time, because it looks like we're not going anywhere for a while. Um, so today, I'm doodling my dog Winston. Uh, he's right over here. So if you would like to learn how to draw Winston, follow along. All right, so one of the important things about Winston is his eyeballs. So I'm going to start by giving him two eyeballs, kind of like that. They're very skinny letter O's. And then before I fill it in, I'm going to make two smaller O's inside of it, and I'll color around that. Then another important thing about Winston is his nose. My mom says he has the most perfect dog nose she's ever seen in her life. So when I doodle him, I try to get his nose right. Like that. So that shape, I start off with a smushed rainbow, like that. It's been flattened down towards the ground. I put two legs on that, and then I make a smushed letter V, or a smushed letter U, and then inside of that I'm putting basically a circle on either side. Then it, whoops, line up the middle. Just one line though, not both. Then he needs some eyebrows because Winston is a standard schnauzer with big long eyebrows that I don't trim as often as I'm supposed to. So he's got some eyebrows like that. Also because he's a standard schnauzer he has a big wild unkempt beard like this. It's very important when you scribble Winston's beard that you're scribbling it. If you try to draw it neatly it will not look like a schnauzer. Then in the middle, I usually make his mouth kind of like that because Winston has a very unimpressed mouth. He very rarely looks like he cares about what's going on. Uh, next, I'm going to make his ears. These are also done as kind of scribbles, so I'm going to start with the marks where his ears will start. I'm going to go scribble, 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 scribble. Then I'm going to kick the pen out on either side like this. And a couple more scribbles on either side will finish it off. If you want to make the top of Winston's head behind his eyebrows, you can. Uh, next, I'm going to give him some chest hair. Winston has very manly chest hair. And then I'm going to make his collar like so. And we'll do a couple scribbles on here to add some shading by his neck. And then two lines kicking out to start his legs. And then because he's a standard schnauzer, he's very shaggy in his legs. And then we give him his little overgrown flower paw hair, like so. And his belly. And I'm going to have his leg kicked out back here, like he's sitting down wondering what's going on. And there's Winston. All right, so there's our Winston. Hopefully you were able to follow along at home and yours came out exactly how you wanted it to. Uh, I'll post another video again tomorrow, so follow along. Um, and we'll see what I feel like drawing tomorrow, and hopefully you'll feel like drawing the same thing, because uh, we need to get through this together, because th otherwise we're both going to be really bored. Um, so check back tomorrow. If you can't wait that long, check out my Instagram. It's at Mike Page Studios. I might try to post some um, time la time lapse videos uh, for you guys to enjoy so that we can all get through this together. Stay home. <laughs>